We are right now in the beginning of a climate and ecological crisis. And we need to call it what it is, an emergency. Because we are facing an existential threat and there is no time to continue down this road of madness. We have waited far too long to do something large enough to solve the problem. What we used to call climate change has now become a climate emergency. You know, my uh, generation is largely responsible for creating this climate emergency. And we have a moral obligation to take decisive action to solve the climate crisis. There's not much time left now. But if we all work together, take bold action and move quickly, then we can still make it in time. East Hampton is the first town in New York State to set ambitious 100% renewable energy goals. And the town is well on its way to generate more than enough clean energy to power our entire community. And now there's great momentum to do the same across the state of New York and the entire nation. And these are not just proposals, they're not just ideas. We don't do that here in New York. Our agenda reflects the urgency. The agreements we signed today will start moving on these projects now. Some wanted our nation to pull out of the Paris Agreement, but states all across the country responded by forming the United States Climate Alliance. This is not a time to sit back and hope that the problem fixes itself. This is the time to respond to the climate crisis. And the good news is, we've got all the tools we need in our toolbox. What we need now is the political will to do the job. And we're so lucky to live at exactly the moment in time when each of us can help overcome the greatest challenge humanity has ever faced. So I ask you to please wake up and make the changes required possible. To do your best is no longer good enough. We now need to do the seemingly impossible. And so that's up to all of us. All of us need to help to make this happen. Thank you.